I hope you don't feel too uncomfortable talking about bathroom activities, because I want to tell you about something I really love. The bum gun. The bum gun? Yeah, it's the gun that you use to clean your bum off after doing your business on the toilet. Well, actually, it looks more like this, and instead of bullets, it has water. Of course, you don't only find it in Vietnam. They also have it in Thailand, Malaysia, and probably some other countries I've never been to. Nevertheless, a lot of Americans would be pretty weirded out if you suggested they use one. I'm supposed to use what on my what? I was a bit weirded out at first too, but once I got used to it, I was in love. It's such a quick, thorough, and comfortable way to clean yourself off. Prior to my first trip to Asia, back in 2008, I had always thought the American way was the only sensible way. But now, it seems like such a torturous ordeal to me. Oh, the pain! I don't know if it's even possible to buy and install a bum gun here in America. I've tried my own solutions, but it's just not the same. <laughs> when you sit down to a meal in America, you've got a fork, knife, spoon, and usually a plate of hamburgers, in which case the utensils are kind of useless. But sometimes we eat salads, and other things like that that have a lot of small pieces. Eating salad with a fork, you always have to be finding some thicker object to stab the leaves against. And sometimes at the end, you end up just stabbing the same leaf over and over again, hoping that it'll stick. But with chopsticks, you just pick it right up. Chopsticks are useful in lots of other situations too. So why can't Americans put them on the table? We do sometimes use chopsticks if we go to a Japanese or Chinese restaurant or a pho place. But in the average American restaurant, or the average American home, you probably couldn't find a single pair of chopsticks. They aren't suitable in every situation, of course, but why can't Americans just add them into the mix? Fork, knife, spoon, and chopsticks. Seems like a great idea, but until it happens, I'm going to take my own chopsticks everywhere I go in this country.